This is parenthood, you guys. She takes two bites and the rest ends up all over the floor and probably all in her seat as well. You happy? Hello. What's up, guys? Good morning. I know this red lip is very full on. It is a very bright red lip, but it is Valentine's Day today and I figured why the heck not? If you're going to wear a red lip, it's going to be on Valentine's Day. I know it's very cliche to wear red lips on Valentine's Day, but hey. Jamie's off to, I don't know, man. He's been real stuff this morning. I think he has some sort of like secret Valentine's Day thing planned or whatever. I'm not sure. He kept saying, I need to go and pick up something. And I, and I said to him, where are you going to pick it up? And he's like, just somewhere. <laughs> He's really bad at like secrets and stuff. Like I already knew he was getting me something for Valentine's Day and I know that it's not gonna be Anything big as he said, but yeah, like I said, he's he's just not the most subtle guy ever I got him a little Valentine's Day gift as well. It's just over there on the table It's just something like personal <laughs> Good morning guys, so excuse how red my face is, excuse all the peeling on my forehead, I was out in the sun way too long at that lowrider show, now I'm paying the price of not wearing sun cream. I just got down to the shopping center, I'm going to go and pick up a couple of things for Valentine's Day. This year I wanted to try and recreate a really good memory from back in the day, uh, way back in the day when Nikki and I were just dating. I surprised her with a picnic in the botanical gardens. Like I gave her clues of how to get there. She didn't know where she was going. I told her the tram she had to get on and then she had to find me in the gardens. I was sitting there with a picnic blanket and all this stuff on it. And we just had the most amazing day that day. We played Connect Four and I completely kicked her butt pretty much every single game. We talked about the future. We talked about one day having kids. And I gave her this really nice jar that was full of all of her favorite candy. Now when I first first met Nikki, she was the biggest candy addict that I had ever met. She literally would have a different bag of candy in every handbag that she owned. Come to think of it, I, I, I think that may have been one of the reasons why I fell for her because I knew that no matter what the scenario was, she would always have candy on her at all times and I really like candy too. I wanted to try and recreate that memory, so I'm down here at the supermarket. The other day I went and I bought a jar for the candy. I'm gonna go get the candy now, put all of her favorite candy in it and Nikki really loves the pancake parlor, so I'm gonna go and get takeaway pancake parlor. I'm gonna go home, I'm gonna set up the picnic blanket inside. I was gonna do it in the backyard and surprise her with it, but unfortunately it's kind of cold outside today and it looks like it's gonna rain, so I will just set it up inside. I just wanted to remind her that even though I don't make the same sort of romantic gestures as I did in the early days or I don't do them as frequently as I did. I just wanted to remind her that I love her just as much or even more so than I did back in the day when I used to do all that stuff. It's just a natural transition that a, a relationship goes through that you know when you've been together for a long time sometimes you let the romance slip just a little bit and that's completely normal it happens in every relationship but I just wanted to remind her that I just I still really really love her and you know she's she's the woman of my dreams and I'm just so happy to be with her and I just wanted to bring back memories from that day and just put a smile on her face so that's what today's all about good job I'm so proud of you can tell she's thirsty as she's like eating her yogurt like it's a drink <laughs> all right so one thing that i really liked about that day was kicking nikki's butt at connect four so you know i had to come through and get myself another connect four so that i could kick some butt again um i came into kmart but for some reason they didn't have the original connect four they only had the ghetto version lineup four but eh, it'll do the same thing all right so i've got food flowers candy all set I just got home and it looks like luck is on my side. The sun is shining now, all the grey clouds are gone, the sky is really nice and blue. So I'm really happy. I had to just ask Nikki to stay in her room while I set everything up. She's like, Jamie, what's going on? What have you done? Um, 
So I just set everything up. This is how it's looking. Yes, I know the presentation could be a little bit better, but that's a little bit more up Nikki's alley than mine. Um, but yeah, that's that's what we're looking at, and I'll go grab Nikki now. Hey, baby, you can come out now. All right, we've got to go out to the backyard. So it's nothing. It's so nothing huge. <laughs> you seem excited. Huge my butt. Why are we having there for so long? Oh so Come on, let's go out the back. Do I have to close my eyes or something? No. <laughs> I really hope I'm not getting your expectations too high. Yo, I'm scared now. Yeah, that's why. That's why I'm scared. I. I've gone and got her expectations really high. I promise it's nothing big. No, I don't want to go outside. <laughs> it's nothing big. Just come out. Aww. <laughs> I just remember that day in the botanical gardens mm -hmm. where we had that picnic. I, you I, recreated our yeah. first date. It's not our first date. It's just our best our date. Our first proper date. Yeah, so I just wanted to to let you know that I still love you the same way as I did back then even though I don't do as much romantic stuff anymore and I went and I got all your favorite lollies and that's why this morning when I saw a lolly jar I was like oh man <laughs> we it's thought this is yeah it's so funny because this morning for Valentine's Day Nikki gave me a lolly jar with all of my favorite stuff I'm like man we think too much alike <laughs> Aww. And we got the Connect Four, and I went to Pancake Parlor and got us some pancakes. Oh, yum. That's, that's why I said it was time sensitive because I didn't want them to. The, I didn't want the ice cream to melt, but the ice cream already melted. Did it? Yeah, Aww. it's long gone. Thanks, happy babe. Valentine's Day, bud. Oh, happy Valentine's happy Day. Happy Valentine's Day to you too, so Ava. Glad you like it. Uh, let me go get Louis. I had to. <laughs> Yeah, some cutlery while you're at it. Mm-hmm. I had to lock Louie in baby jail while I was setting everything up so that he didn't eat it while I was back in this room. That would be a real disaster. Amy and I are literally the same person. I <laughs> know, right? Like, We're this is alike. how you know you've been married a long ass time. So I just wanted to show you what Nikki got me. So she got me this jar full of candy, or my favorite lollies. Warheads, sour stuff, Turkish delights. And then, and then there's all these little envelopes in here and inside are little things that she really loves about me. And the idea is for, you know, when we have a fight or when I'm feeling down to open one of these and just read nice things about myself, which is really nice. And then she got me a card as well, which I forgot to get her a card, so let's open this card. Is it private or can I read it on camera? No, you can read it. My better half, in the long and winding road we call life, I'm so glad you're riding next to me. Even if you're shouting, look out, look out half the time. Happy <laughs> Valentine's Day, that's so <laughs> us. That is so us. I'm not even that bad of a driver, your ass still like, let <laughs> It's so annoying, you guys. I laugh, I laugh, but it's really not that funny. Neck four, eh? Mm, Look at Ava just doing her own thing. Ava's doing her own thing. I wonder if we could sneak a game in. No, the second we start playing, she's Look at her face fight. already. Yeah. She's like, oh, people uh, having uh, fun? Uh, oh, let no me come. fun without me. People having fun? <laughs> I won. Damn it. You did that on Vervets. I actually did. You did. I can see by your face. No, I actually did it. Come on, son. I was son. looking forward to kicking your butt. Come on, son. That is clear as day. One, two, three, four. I won. No, what was I thinking? I was too busy watching Ava. Mate, you're the biggest liar. You're the worst liar ever. I did not let you win. Promise you didn't let me no, win. I promise. Yo! You know it's real when you pick your promises. Slipping. Yes. I am slipping at my Connect 4 she game. She still has it. What do you she mean still, still has, has it? You used to always lose. She still has a touch, A. Eh? I was she hoping still you still I was hoping she you still, still had it. Touch. Mommy still has the touch. Mommy still has the touch. Look at Amy dancing. Mommy still has the touch, A. Eh? Mommy still Mommy's has the touch, A. Eh? 
She always turns up for mommy man. Every time I start singing, she girl starts dancing. Mommy still got the touch, ayy. 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 Yo, Ava, I love you, man. This is why you had a kid, right? So you have your own personal cheer squad for the rest of your life. You are correct, young grasshopper. <laughs> she's literally my cheerleader. Yo, oh, Ava. She's got grass on her lolly. Uh, Ava, I appreciate you, man. Cause you, you I appreciate, <laughs> I appreciate you, man. Hey, mama still got the moves. 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 Hey, go shake it one time, shake it one time, shake it one time, shake it one time. So we've just brought the kids down to the park. By the kids, I mean Ava and Lou and this guy. Uh, I thought you were talking about me. Oh yeah, and this guy too. He's definitely the biggest kid of them all. But um, big kid at times. After our that. little picnic, we had a nap. We had a family nap. This is what happens when you get married, man. Valentine's Day, you cute, you do some cute stuff, and then you take a nap. And that's like the best part of the day. And I had a good nap too. You know those good naps where like, you wake up and you're like, why am I even awake? You wanna go back to sleep, but it's not the same. Mm -hmm. That's the kind of nap that we had. <laughs> Yo, Ava. Are you guys brothers? No, no, cousins. Cousins, you all look the same. No, we don't. Are you guys triplets? No, no. he's older. Are you sure? He's, he's young nine. nine. He's eight. I'm seven. He's turning oh, that's ten. That's so cute. Ten. Wow. 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 Was that fun? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Ava spotted these chickens and she's so excited. She knows what noise they make. Hi, chickens. <laughs> we packed the pram because we were going to go for a walk and then we got to the park and we were like, nah, we'll just chill at the park. We don't need the pram. And now we're going for this long walk. Is she getting heavy? Oh, <laughs> so Oh my goodness, you guys are so silly. You guys are so silly. Louie, they're What's silly, you aren't they? You say hi to the camera! <laughs> hey, tickle mummy. Can you tickle mummy? <laughs> well, that's it for today. We just had a really relaxing night. We sat down and we watched a really good movie called Hidden Figures. Mm -hmm. It was good, yeah? Yeah, it was really good. It was very inspiring. Mm, and sad. I just... When I watch movies like that, it just, it, it, I can just never get my head around the fact that people lived like that. People were completely thought of as second class citizens, brilliant minds. My, like, it just, it makes you think how many other brilliant minds were stopped from doing really amazing things just due to really simple minds it's just it, it it baffles me i just can't get my head around it still today was just a really nice family day huh it was a nice family day thanks for my flowers they smell really nice love you